Yeah, like to be able to le- lead clearly, but without force. You're right, 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 right. That's like kind of my mantra, um, I would say. Um, I think so. What I love to do in some workshops, especially with like sensual stuff, um, is really talking about moves as breaths. Um, and like when I start and I social dance with like a new partner and they're like, I'm here in a close position. I'll literally just breathe with them, like up yeah. and down, and try to like gain some like connection and try exactly, to feel exactly. what they're comfortable with, and also just get us like connected in that moment. And yeah. it's something that I felt from Juan Calderon, and I felt this like breathing thing, and I was like, oh, this is so nice. And so I just like took it, and I do it all the time now. Um, but I think of dancing like a social dance is like a relationship. Like you're having this like three minute relationship with somebody. And like, if you think of it as like going on a date, right. It's like when you meet someone for the first time, you're not going to be like, okay, let's move in. Let's have babies and let's like do all this stuff. Right. 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 You gotta like get to know each other a little bit first talk, you know, like kind of check each other out, like see where you're at. Are you on the same page? Are you not? Okay. Let's try to get on the same page. Okay. We're not going to get on the same page. Let's okay. Let's just like stick to like small talk, you know? So like small talk would be just, okay. If you're not comfortable with it, (laughs) just do a basic left turn. Um, So I think, and then I always like talking about like same thing, like even a relationship. So like, let's say like you move really quickly. Okay. They're like good with babies and stuff. So you're going to do all that. Like, okay, but we got to like check back in. Are you still doing good? How are you doing after this? Okay. Let's like check back in. I think thinking of it as like, um, more than just like, I want to show my dance. I really want to, in this moment, like make this a really good experience for like both people in there where we're like, we're one being in this yeah moment, you know what i mean um so i think taking things slow in a social dance and being okay with like the moments where you feel like you're not doing anything or like that it's not going to look like you're doing anything right and just where it's just you and that person are the only people that know what's going on in that moment and then you can break away and then you can come back and like check back in um i think that's like the biggest thing and then the second thing is like um, own like getting really good at your own body movement um, because for and I always say to people that want to learn sensual is that if you want to lead all of these things body manipulations on another person like you better be able to do that yourself too right uh huh right so I think by under and that's why I think a lot of follows become really good leads um, because they have already understood how the body is supposed to move. And so they can lead it on someone else and know how to counterbalance just like intuitively. So I think, and that's why I continue to train with like all different types of dance, because I think the more body awareness we have, the better we feel. And I always talk about um, leading things with the body. So for example, instead of like prepping a turn, even like a right turn, if I'm prepping a turn like this, right? I'm going to prep here, right? Hey, yeah, that's different. That's the difference too. Um, that way all of the energy, right, is now in my body and is transferring over to the other person as opposed to me trying to use my arm to actually lead it. So I like to think of my arms as just like they're bystanders in my dancing, right? My body is always going to lead the movement that's going to come next, right? And I can just lead without any force if I use my body to lead it. Um, So I think the breath, using the body, um, gaining awareness of your own body movement, um, are like the three biggest things I think I would say.